All right. What we're going to do is we're going to play. Go to game browser. You're going to hit square to create a match or a custom game. Um, here, this is like your dashboard. I usually hit R1 to go into settings. There is a settings button here. But like I said, the, the R1 is just quicker. You've got all these, and once you get into settings, your presets, this is everything that you can save and all the different modes and stuff like that. Um, some of these are fun to play around with. But, all right, so we'll go to, like, we'll make, like, a quick play match. Uh, it'll have all the same settings as just a normal quick play match. Um, you just hit X. It activates it. So over here on the right, summary, we've got assault. Assault Escort, Control and Escort on Quick Play settings. Hit Circle to back out. Now, you go in here to Heroes. You can adjust individual heroes. Like, you can go in here <clears throat> and adjust, you know, anything, really. Um, individually for the heroes, or if you're wanting to do it to all of them, you just go up here to General. And this will affect all the players in the match and of course it's everything um, from your cooldowns to your ultimate generation to uh, there's even a thing at the bottom where you can turn off ammunition requirement you don't reload if you turn that on um, but for right now I'm just gonna go with movement speed crank it up to 150 percent circle and it adds it to the summary on the right so you know exactly what's going on uh, you can go into the hero roster too and toggle on and off individual heroes or all of them or whatever uh, you back out of that you have the game modes here you can select you know obviously it's quick play so you're only gonna have the four um, maps you can toggle them on and off uh, the workshop mode, I don't even know how to mess with that. I'm not even going to attempt. Uh, but that's it. Then you back out to your dashboard again. And you can go over here to add AI. And you can change, you know, which heroes you're wanting to put in. You can change the difficulty. How many you're going to put on the teams. Uh, both teams, you can add them to, you know, each individual team separately. And you just hit square, it throws them in, and just hit start. Now this one is, is just the 150% speed boost. So I use it to uh, practice, like when I jump into a regular match after playing at 150% speed, I jump into a regular match and it's like the entire team is running in slow motion. So for DPS, like that, it, it it's a big move. But yeah, you just hit start, and it'll load up like a regular match. And you can just mess around in it as you want, mess around with all the different settings. It's really not hard once you know where everything's at. It took me a minute to, to get used to the setting, the menus and stuff. Oh, but it helps.